So his name is Cyril. And his Baldi. name is Tillman O'Donnell. Mm. And um, we were working uh, with uh, some students and some professionals from uh, London and from the University of Roehampton and um, giving a workshop. Workshop, an introduction to the work that we've been developing since uh, a few years already. And uh, it's going really well. The work is about sensation and um, finding a way to let sensation inform your dancing, to affirm the sensation of your body before putting some kind of form on top of it. Well. I, I think, I think yes, I think it's to find a, 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 some sort of other presence and other uh, uh, some sort of other body through sensation that results into choreography versus mm -hmm. the inverse, which is like choreography and then finding the sensation. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, how, how are we doing this? I mean, we have like we have series of exercises uh, that we do that uh, entrain this uh, paying attention to uh, fluctuation of sensation throughout the body. We stick with one thing for a long time, and uh, we look at what shows up. So uh, it can be language, it can be uh, feelings, and all this, and we try to like. Uh, uh, let all this uh, sink into into the body and into into sensation, uh, and so all of this uh, informs sensation, and then we like then it transfers again uh, uh, into the world through through dancing. I think most of us uh, have been taught to pay attention to form while we dance, um, even if we are improvising, we're we're operating inside of some kind of even the ghost of some kind of form. And I think what we're trying to do is not abandon form, but uh, um, find, some, find some different sources for form. Mm. And form, form naturally emerges out of that. In, in our case, it probably emerges in a particular way based on our background, but we also see it in a lot of other artists mm -hmm. uh, who express it in, in, in different techniques and in different things. So we're shifting the focus a little bit. We try to wake up the body a little bit through doing different exercises and through sticking with sticking with one thing a little bit longer than than language wants you to, or than your parts of your personality maybe wants you to change, and you have to just stick with it, stay 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 with it. and eventually something very interesting pops up. Mm. And so I think that the core of this whatevering idea is that when that interesting thing pops up, that's the subject matter around which you create a choreography. So the choreography becomes the frame to let that subject matter have buoyancy in life and be shown to people. Mm. So the choreography is the, is the kind of invitation to the public. Mm. Thank you. You're welcome.